Did you hear what happened? What happened? What else could it be? This time the bear destroyed the hive. I am very sorry to hear that. We should give a lesson to the bear. This shouldn't happen. First of all, nobody should say hello to the bear. Yes, and even when we see it, we must turn our back to it. Yes, I think the bear did it. Who else can do it? So when we are done, we will send the bear away from this forest. What? What? Surely the Surely bear stole, the bear my, stole honey. my honey. Huh. Can you be, huh. so, can you be so unjust with me? me? What honey? What honey? I didn't touch I didn't any, touch touch any since honey since that day. You have to you trust, have to me, trust me, me. I'll tell everyone, I'll tell what, everyone, what, you everyone what you did. Surely you'll, Surely you'll be, be very, very sorry. In the future, in the future forget, about forget about stealing my honey. You'll never come you'll into the forest again. You're insulting me. Look, look, look. You'll be sorry. Let's go have a look. Let's go have a look. But I'm sure the bear did You'll see. You'll see. How can they think about me this way? If I don't find who's guilty, it'll be one awful day for me. Who can do this? Who loves a honey more than I do? Where's Ahmed? But he doesn't do it without permission. And if he did, he wouldn't turn over the beehive. How did you spend the day today, Ahmed? I played with Snowball and Birdie. We walked in the forest, and I helped Mom a little bit. What kind of help? She was cleaning the house, and I helped to arrange the pillows. Bravo! What else did you do? I prayed in time, and in the afternoon, Mother read me a book. Which book, my son? The book about Imam Ghazali. He lived 900 years ago during Selchuk dynasty. He was a teacher and had lots of students, and he wrote a lot of books. How did you learn all of this, my son? In the beginning of the book, it was written, The Life of Imam Ghazali. Which one of the books were you reading, my son? The book is called... Ihya Ulumuddin, short is I-H-Y-A, Ihya. Can you tell me something you are reading? I want to learn a little. To be unjustly suspicious means to be suspicious about someone who doesn't deserve it. We read that chapter. There are so many things we didn't know. I think everyone must read this book. There are many beautiful things in that book. What is it to be suspicious, my son? To think something bad about someone, to be suspicious about someone, or to suppose that someone is guilty when there's no proof about his guilt, or to tell wrong about the deeds of someone. Well, briefly, suspiciousness is to think badly about an innocent person that he or she is guilty, and then to act accordingly. Suspiciousness is a big sin, and a law doesn't forgive it.